Welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4 Mod Weekly, where we showcase the best mods released this week. In this episode, we'll be taking a look at the top Fallout 4 mods released second week of April 2023. From weapons to retextures, settlements to dungeons, we've got it all covered. Not only that, but thanks to your support. From now on, we are with you with a better Nora voice. Thank you very much. Now sit back, relax, and let's dive into the amazing world of Fallout 4 modding. At first, let's talking about the Stoner Rifle 25, Knight's Armaments, and Glock 17 MOS Glock 18 mod. This mod is perfect for players who want to take their combat abilities to the next level. With customizable weapons from Modern Warfare 2022, this mod will give you an edge over your enemies. Let's start by talking about the Stoner Rifle 25. This weapon is a modified AR-10 assault rifle that fires a 7, 62 NATO round. With this mod, you can fully customize the rifle, from the ammunition to the optics. The mod includes a variety of attachments such as suppressors, bipods, and scopes. The sound effects and animations for this weapon are also taken directly from Modern Warfare 2022, which adds an extra level of immersion to your gameplay. Next, we will introduce the Glock 17 MOS Glock 18. There are a total of 12 pistols in this mod. These are pistols that fire 10 mm rounds and have magazine capacities ranging from 17 to 50 rounds. This weapon is perfect for close combat situations where you need to quickly take down an enemy. The shooting feel of these pistols is great overall. The reload motion and sound are also of high quality. Some pistols, especially equipped with XRK pistol stock, have a SMG feel to them. If you modify these pistols properly, you can enjoy a different kind of fun. The Stoner Rifle 25, Knight's Armaments, and Glock 17, MOS Glock 18 mod is a must-have for anyone looking to add some seriously powerful firepower to their Fallout 4 experience. With customizable weapons from Modern Warfare 2022, you'll have a blast taking on enemies in the wasteland. At second, we are taking a look at the Nordic Europa Research Facility mod for Fallout 4. This mod adds a large underground facility that was once home to bright minds researching nuclear science, biology, and alternative energy. But now, it's filled with feral ghouls, making it a challenging and exciting dungeon to explore. The Nordic Europa Research Facility is a dungeon mod that consists of six large interiors, each filled with lore, loot, easter eggs, and enemies. The mod is designed to provide a challenge for higher level characters who enjoy mowing down hordes of feral ghouls. The mod has an emphasis on good performance and nice looking lighting, as well as embracing the science-y feel of Fallout. It features unique interiors and props that give it a distinct feel from other dungeon mods. The Nordic Europa Research Facility is located near the Cambridge Police Station. To enter the dungeon, you need at least an advanced hacker perk, so make sure you have that before you head out to explore this exciting new area. At the end of the dungeon, you'll find an interior workshop and a large open hall where you can build to your heart's content. This mod offers a great mix of combat and exploration, with plenty of lore to discover along the way. The Nordic Europa Research Facility also features ported sounds, animations, and models in both first- and third-person perspectives, making it a fully immersive experience. The Nordic Europa Research Facility mod is a must-try for Fallout 4 players who are looking for a challenging dungeon mod with unique interiors and props. With its focus on performance and lighting, you won't have to worry about any lag or stuttering as you explore this exciting new area. So make sure to check it out and let us know what you think in the comments below. Next, we're taking a look at the MW2 XRK Family Mod, which adds two new pistols from Modern Warfare 2022 into the game. Specifically, we have the Glock 17 and 18, which are some of the most popular handguns in the real world and the gaming universe. First up, we have the X12, a light semi-automatic 9mm pistol that is perfect for tactical use. Advanced receiver can lower weight and increase DPS, rate of fire, and damage. Modifying the barrel can increase its range and accuracy. This pistol supports several types of silencers and compensators, so you can choose and customize it. Next, we have the X-13, a full auto variant of the X-12 that is an absolute powerhouse in close combat situations. With a high rate of fire and the ability to selectively modify between semi-auto and full-auto modes, the X-13 is perfect for taking down multiple enemies quickly. Like the X-12, the
The X13 also has various customization options, allowing you to tailor it to your liking. But what truly sets this mod apart is its support for two types of reload animations. In addition to the basic reload animation, this mod additionally supports fast hand animations. You can select animations in the weapon workbench, and fast hand reloads faster, and still feels natural. The MW2 XRK family mod is a must-have for any Fallout 4 player who loves firearms. The X12 and 13 are both fantastic weapons that add a new dimension to your arsenal, and the attention to detail put into the mod is top-notch. So if you're looking for a new way to experience Fallout 4, be sure to give this mod a try. If you're tired of the game's low-quality textures on turrets, this mod is for you. The retextures for turrets mod is a must-have for any Fallout 4 player who wants to improve the game's graphics. The creator of this mod has done an incredible job, and the new textures are so detailed and realistic that you'll think you're playing a new game. This mod changes the textures of turrets to high-quality ones, offering you a choice between 1K, 2K, and 4K textures. The Retextures for Turrets mod is a great example of how mods can enhance the gameplay experience. The modder's attention to detail is amazing, and they've done a fantastic job of making the turrets look more like real-world weapons. This mod will make your turrets look rusty, new, and powerful, which is sure to add to your immersion in the game. This mod offers several benefits, including The Retextures for Turrets mod replaces the game's original textures with high-quality ones, offering you an unparalleled level of detail. You can choose between 1K, 2K, and 4K textures depending on your computer's capabilities. The improved textures will enhance your immersion in the game, making the turrets look more realistic and powerful. The Retextures for Turrets mod is a must-have for any Fallout 4 player who wants to enhance their gaming experience. The improved textures are incredibly detailed, making the turrets look more like real-world weapons. This mod is an excellent example of how mods can improve a game's graphics and make it more immersive. So, if you're looking for a mod that will improve the game's visuals, look no further than Retextures for Turrets. If you're a fan of realistic military-style weapons, then this mod is definitely for you. It adds a highly customizable HK416 assault rifle to the game, complete with authentic textures and sounds. The HK416 is a gas-operated selective fire weapon chambered for the 5, 56, 45mm NATO cartridge. It's widely used by military and law enforcement personnel around the world, and now you can add it to your arsenal in Fallout 4. The mod includes both black and tan color options for the weapon, so you can choose the one that suits your playstyle best. One of the coolest features of this mod is the level of customization it offers. You can attach a laser sight to the upper rail and a grip to the lower rail to improve your accuracy and control. There are also various stock lengths, suppressors, and magazine sizes to choose from, so you can really make the gun your own. The textures and sounds in this mod are top-notch and really add to the immersive feel of the weapon. You'll feel like you're using a real HK416 on the battlefield, and it's sure to make your playthrough of Fallout 4 even more enjoyable. This rifle has a tactical reload animation, and you need to install the tactical reload framework to use it. RON HK416 mod is a must-have for anyone who loves military-style weapons in Fallout 4. The level of customization and attention to detail is impressive, and the gun looks and sounds fantastic in-game. So if you want to add a powerful and versatile assault rifle to your arsenal, be sure to check out this mod. Thanks for tuning in to this week's episode of Fallout 4 Mod Weekly Best. We hope you enjoyed the mods we showcased today and found something new to enhance your gameplay experience. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more Fallout 4 mod content every week. Also, be sure to check out the links in the description to download these amazing mods for yourself. See you next time.